Hi guys. I just wanted to come um, to you um, and show you my favorite 10 or my top 10 um, lipsticks for brown girls. So, um, or just for any um, woman in general who like these colors. But um, in my opinion, they really flatter um, uh, us brown girls just because, you know, there's so many uh, baby doll pinks and this and that and a lot of us um, really are, you know, aren't into um, all that. So, I'll show you my array of uh, hues of brown, red, gold, and pink. So, the first one is going to be um, NYX Sparkling Flamingo. And it looks like that. I'm going to try to see if I can do these swatches because I swatched them kind of awkward. Uh, that's it. How about this? Let me see if I just swatch it right here. And it's just a pretty pink with a hint of gold undertones. Next one is Medusa by NYX. Um, that's what it looks like. And I'll swatch it right next to it. Right here, and it's like a purpley, um, plummy color with um, uh, pink sparkles of reflex in it. It's really pretty. The next one is Mac Fetish, and it is a frost. Looks like that. It's kind of a pinky brown um, color. Well, kind of copperish. I don't know. But it's really pretty. Then there's MAC Trimming Talk. And it's a frost. And this is like this bright pink color. But you can pull it off with a um a lip liner like Vino or um any dark um lip liner you have you can kinda um warm it up. That's trimming talk. And it's just a bright, um, frosty, uh fuchsia kinda pink. Then there is uh, amplified by a letter, and that's that. And it's just what it says, kind of like a violet color. I'm gonna come and see if I could do my swatches. I already had a violet is right there, right beside trim and talk. My favorite, which I'm wearing right now, with the Vino Lip Liner, is Plum Dandy. It is a frost. It looks like this. And <coughs> this is Plum Dandy. Let me re-swatch it. I don't think that's going to work. Mm, can you see it? Like this goldish pink, I don't know, it's very pretty, frosty gold pink with a like brown undertone, it's, it's a good neutral color, and it goes with a lot of makeup, and Victoria's Secret, very sexy, and dusk, looks like that, it is a nudie, goldish, um, brown color or a brown with gold reflex and I'm going to swatch it right there. I hope you can see these colors. It's very pretty. 
very good um, neutral lip. Uh, Victoria's Secret and Sex Kitten. And it's this pink right here. And it's just a pretty, it almost looks like trimming um, talc except for it's a little sheerer um, and less expensive. The other one is Mary Kay. It is gold dust. Looks like this. A very gold color. It says it's, the color says it. I mean the name says it all. Gold dust. And it's a very pretty gold color. <clears throat> Reminds me of um, the Leprechaun's Pot of Gold. Um, this is Bobby Brown <clears throat> in Copper Red. And indeed, it is a Copper Red. I love when um, um, companies make names for um, their items that explains it to the T. Um, and that's what this is. Copper Red. Kind of like a burnt orange. Um, rustic color. I love it. Anyway, um, I'm about to go to bed, so I just want to come real quick and show you those. Um, I tried to, um, do, a, um, I tried to compile a, a bunch of, um, you know, high-end, cheap ones, you know, whatever, because, um, I know everyone can afford Mac or Bobby Brown, and NYX um, lipsticks are, um, in my opinion, just as good and as pigmented. So, um, yeah, I don't know if Victoria's Secret still, um, I know every Victoria's Secret doesn't carry makeup, but if you can find those colors, um, they are great also. So, I hope you liked um, my lipstick picks, and talk to you later.